Hello and welcome to Yao Guai Gaming where we are playing Ark and Salt is really really strong. Look how, look how high level he is. I love Salt. Salt's amazing. He's by far the best dinosaur we have and obviously RG is the best flying thing we have because he's the only flying thing we have. Right, I rearranged my storage a tiny bit and now I've lost everything. There we go. So. What we're planning on doing is trying to figure out how we grow stuff because I don't know how plants work in real life and in arc. So I'm thinking we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Then we need our way in, which is there. Perfect. Right, this is the start of our empire of berries. So what do I need to make? Uh, is, it, is it this? Is this what it is? Plant. Small crop plot. Ah, the crop plot. It's fiber, stone, thatch, and wood, and we'll make nine of them. Can we walk on them? I suppose this is what we'll find out, isn't it? Right, so we want nine of them. So what was it? Fiber, fiber, stone, thatch, wood. Just the usual basic stuff. Okay, and then... Oh. Oh. It uses quite a bit of stone, actually. All right. Now can I make nine? No, I can only make five. Oh, it makes uses a lot of wood as well. Fair enough. All right, so we need another four. And we can only make three, of course. Stone. This is fantastic. <laughs> Right, here we go. Plot. And now we can make another four. Right, let's just see if this is actually doing anything. It's not, so we'll turn it off. And there's the four, so let's put everything away. We need to collect some more resources. I have done some resource collecting off camera. For this mostly, um, but it never seems to be quite enough. Oh shit, they're tiny! All right, let's maybe put the walls down first so I know whether or not it fits. Yeah, because I don't currently know what fits in there or not. Right, let's put that there, there, and right. Walls, so it's greenhouse. I can't make it in my inventory. It's got to be made here. Why can it not be made here? Oh, because I'm typing the wrong thing. I'm an idiot. Leave me alone. Greenhouse, cementing paste, crystal, and metal. Cementing paste. We got some here from Beaver Dam we found, which is really cool. And crystal. Let's hide. Crystal. Crystal, we have actually been flying around on RG and getting crystal, which is really cool. Right, so we can only make seven, we need to make eight. What are we lacking? Probably crystal. Let's click seven. And let's just bring the rest of the crystal over. Right. There we go. So now we can make one more of them, one of them, and one of them. Take that, take that, and take that. Right, and then this should give us the sort of basic structure of the building. It should at least show us how many things we can fit into this place. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I can't count. I need three more. I cannot count. All right, never mind. There we go. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, that really is 
very pretty until something comes along and stomps on it. So I need three more of them. Okay. Steve was covered in blood earlier. It was very concerning. I had to go and check on him. I don't know what's injured him, but... And as you can see, we've got some spare tools. Uh, they're the only things, them and the spear, are the only useful stuff I've found in dinosaur loot so far. You know, dinosaurs that I've fought while I've been out there scavenging. Um, that's it so far, which is a shame. Hopefully we'll find something decent soon. And there we go. Okay, so this is a greenhouse. I'm assuming it's going to need a roof. How do we make the roofs then? Let's have a look at the engrams. Okay, so we've got... Triangle ceiling, sloped wall, sloped roof. Right, so the same as, as that then. Alright, we'll put some sloped roofs on then. So we'll need... One, two, three, four, five, six sloped ceilings two of each sloped walls and two more regular walls and then three regular ceilings. We might not have enough crystal for that actually. We might genuinely not have enough crystal for that. Um, sloped wall right two. Sloped wall left two. Yep, we're out of crystal. Oh, feck. All right, we're going to have to go collect some more crystal. That's fine. That's fine. It's it's only up there. It's up there. And then there's some on a little hill over there as well. Basically, to find crystal, I don't know if I've been doing it right or not. All I've been doing is going to the tallest things I can see. That looks really nice. I did it wrong. I was going to do it the other way. Bugger. Shit, can I pick them up? Uh, pick up. Pick up. I can pick them up if I do it quick. There we go! Haha! <laughs> Fixed my mistake. Yeah, I was going to do it this way instead. I can't believe it. I put all four down and then realised I was doing it wrong. Wait, no. That's exactly the fucking same. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Right, right, wait, 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 so. I know what I want. I want it here. There we go. There. 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 And there, right, there we go. There we go. The brain worked that time, just, just a little bit. Right, let's see, what have we got in our inventory? We've got these nine plots. They're actually quite heavy. I'm gonna stick them into barrage while we wait. I'll take this hide out of him. An otter! I desperately want that otter. Shit, right, I need fish. Oh no, where's it gone? It's there, right. We desperately, desperately, desperately want the otter. Um... There are no fish nearby. Fuck. There, fish. Get the spear out. Right, otter. Because that, that's the first otter I've seen in, in ages. Where is it? I want to replace my otter. Where's it gone? Um, is that it there? Yeah, it's into the water. Hello, otter. Oh no, Barry, no, why would you do that? You prick. Uh, stay there. Don't fish, don't seek fish. Don't do anything, you absolute asshole, Barry. 
Oh, no, it's following me. Go away. Is that the otter down there? It is, yeah. Alright, let's see. Hello. I want to be friends with you. I'm going to attack this fish here for you. Alright, this fish is going to attack me. Come on then, piranha. Let's do it. I feel like I should be able to beat a piranha. Now that I've got my spear and my armor and stuff. If I hit it. Right, where's the otter? Oh no, more piranhas. Right, where where is it gone? Bugger. There, there. Right, so we've got one piranha. Come here. It's gonna take like five fish to feed him, isn't it? Here you go. Uh, it's gonna take four fish to feed him, okay. I see another fish over there. As long as he stays in this bit of water, we should be able to get him. Right, let's grab this fish, as long as Barry doesn't go near it. Right, there we go. And... Yay, I'm gonna replace the otter. Where's he gone? Oh no. I'm gonna feed him like f three fish and he's just gonna vanish. Starving, let's sod off. Right, there we go. Oh, and I'm still carrying all this. Um... There he is. Still carrying all this. No, 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 I'm under attack. Right, where's it? Where's he gone? There. We need to repair our armor then. To be honest, having the piranhas coming up is kind of helping the situation a little bit. Get out of the way, you silly fish. Oh, I can't feed you to the otter if you're in my face like this. Where's he gone now? Oh, for feck's sake. I've lost it. I've lost the otter. There he is. This is going to be a ridiculously time consuming process, isn't it? Me just chasing this otter with piranhas. Come here. No, look, I'm trying to feed you. Right, two more. There's some fish over here. How's our health? Not actually brilliant. Can't eat underwater apparently. Another couple of piranhas would finish us off, maybe. Ah, oh, we stabbed it twice, we shouldn't have stabbed it twice. There we go, right, let's take this to the otter. If we can see it. It's gotta be somewhere. It's gotta be somewhere around here. Well, we've gone too far. Up. I mean, realistically, it could be anywhere, couldn't it? <sighs> Why are they so difficult to get? You, am I supposed to just. Can I bowler the otter? <laughs> can I hear that? would be useful if I could bowler the otter. Right, I'm gonna assume he's somewhere back down in this pond, because that's where he likes to be. What's that? Is that gonna be aggressive to me? No, I think he's gone. Unless, wait a second, unless, unless, let's get out of the water and take something. Does he appear on my tame screen? He does. What are you? I don't even know what you are. 
Uh, go away. There he is. I am a genius. You know, I, I, I'm not. I used a really obvious feature in the game, but still, that's really helpful. <laughs> To second. And are you going to follow me now? Yeah, he's following me. Level 82, Jesus. Right. And then we can turn the tracking thing off. I still have no idea what that is. Pego Master. I don't even know what Pego Master is. Right, hello Otter, um, how are you? What are you good at? You're pretty much good at nothing. I mean, you're an Otter. You've got some increase in melee damage. On Reddit, someone told me that melee damage directly increases their ability to keep me warm. So that's cool. If it's true. <laughs> I don't know how much I trust anyone in the community <laughs> telling me stuff. I don't know if they're doing it just to fuck with me. Right. Let's fix our boots. And I think our boots are the only thing that's super damaged. And that's because, you know, they're on our feet and that's where the things are attacking. Uh, no, actually, everything's kind of damaged, isn't it? Let's strip naked and fix it all. If we can afford it. Better than it breaking at some really inopportune moment while we're collecting resources. We'll do the same for our pickaxe as well, actually. Okay, and there we go. Then we can put this on, put the hide away, and then we should be able to go and collect, hopefully, the See, I'm gonna, I don't have to get the otter off me now. There we go. Should be able to go and hopefully get the last bit of crystal. So, the crystal, there's crystal up at the top of this mountain, and then there's crystal, there's like a hill in the redwoods. I have not landed in the redwoods though, because I'm scared of doing that. There was a really low level baryonyx down there. But I think something's killed it, to be honest. Or it's just died. I can't see it anymore. And I found a level, like, 14 Spinosaur uh, when I was out swimming around with salt. And I killed it because I don't know if it being alive will block the spawns. It will, like, sort of take up that spawn. I don't know how the spawning works, but I killed it just so that it's out of the way, basically. <laughs> and then hopefully a better one will spawn at some point. What's that? What are you? Carnotaurus. You've got tiny little arms, haven't you? I'm going to leave you alone. Yeah, I don't think we want to bother with that thing right now. So it's, the crystal's usually right at the top. I don't know how long it takes to refresh, actually. I don't think it's back yet, is it? Oh dear. Ha. Huh. Right, I'm going to have trouble then, aren't I, if it's not back yet. Argy's leveled up. Um, let's put another point into his weight. There's a good bird. Hmm. If the crystal up here isn't back, I'm going to have to go somewhere else to get crystal. And the only place I know to get crystal is over there. 
How long does it take for it all to respawn? I don't know. So if I, if I look at the map right... Oh, for God's sake. Let's just fly up so we're not being attacked for it. So if I look at the map, this is everywhere I've explored. I explored the mountain over there for crystal, and I explored the volcano in the middle for crystal. I flew basically straight out of the volcano because it was scary and full of... Oh, what the heck? What the heck are these things? I thought I was safe when I'm flying. Horrible little bastards, right. Yeah, so I did a full loop around the island on RG and I did some crystal gathering on RG as well. That's it. So if the crystal isn't respawned, what I'm gonna what I'm planning on doing is flying to get some new dinos. Specifically the resource gathering dinos that people have told me about in comments. What is this? Patchy. I don't know what that is. It's kind of adorable though. Okay, right, so so what that means is I'm gonna go and fly to two locations. That island there in the bottom right and that mountain there. They're the two places where I've seen dinosaurs that have been recommended to pick up. So it's going to be a bit tricky to get over to that, uh, that mountain due to the rain. So I think we'll go to the island first because we can just find the coast and follow it. Um, the island's a bit concerning because I don't know what spawns on it but I have seen right there's two dinosaurs in this one for stone and one for metal that's what I've been told and the one for metal is called ank something and I only remember it because it sounds like an ank morpog from the disc world Right, and it's not that one. Hello, random crocodile. What level crocodile? Uh, crocodile gone. No, crocodile not gone. Crocodile there. Okay, cool. Let's have a look. I'm really curious about what level you are. Oh, you're nothing. Oh, you can get me. That was really rude of you. I'm gonna kill you for that. I hope you understand that. Can't believe it tried to kill me, how rude. Okay, so the bird's really strong actually. And it seems to get like a healing buff if it eats something, which is really fucking cool. So, yeah, I was trying to say it's not the one that begins with Ank that's on this island. It's this, and the, the Ank one is. Stone? I think the Ank one is stone, so it's not that one. Which means it's the metal one. I don't know, people have given me advice and I don't fully understand <laughs> all of it, but it at least gives me a target, which is good. It gives me something to do so I'm not just floundering in the dark. Because floundering in the dark is usually bad. <clears throat> There's nothing in this lagoon here, which is really cool. I flew over it and it was getting a bit dark, so I didn't get to fully have a, have a look at it. I would have expected there to be, like I said, I don't know, this just looks like a place that a Spinosaur would live, to me. This is a cool place. Uh, again, there's no, like, crystal here or anything. I would have thought there would be some, which is a shame. Could fly under this nice geological arch. To be fair, actually, that's a good point. I don't know if it is geological, because I don't know what the law is behind this place. Is this place supposed to be natural, or is it unnatural? 
What is that's a big shark? That is a very big shark. Where is she? He? Where is it? <gasps> oh, I was right to call it a she. She's beautiful. Is that? Wait a second. Is that an actual alpha? Female alpha megalodon level eight. Should we go back and get and get salt? Do you think salt could take it? Will she despawn? I know that my bird can't take her because she's in the water. I don't want her to despawn that. I want to bring salt down and try and fight her. Ooh, that'll be fun. Yeah, we're going to bring salt over and fight her at some point. Because look, look, there's lots of turtles for us to collect. We need to collect turtles. That's kind of salt's entire existence. It's killing turtles. He's my keratin farm. Right, I think we're almost at this island. I don't, again, like I said, I don't know if there is anything that I need to be particularly cautious of on the island. Probably, I mean, the stuff that's going to eat you everywhere, isn't there? Um, but out of the two islands, out of this island and the island in the north, this one definitely seemed less murderous of the two. That one in the north was just a bit bonkers. It was full of argies killing... Um, is that how you say it? That's that's how it was typed, argies. Is that how you say it? It was full of argiventuses, arg argies. It was full of these feathery cunts killing um, tyrannosauruses. There were like two, two or three tyrannosauruses. All really low leveled, otherwise I would have turned my mic on and tried to tried to capture it, but it was still pretty badass to watch. Hello, what are you? Um, you're off, I guess. Alright, well that's just rude. We've both got wings. We could be friends. Ooh, ooh, I see a spine. I see a spine. Level 60. What's the point? Come on. What level are you? You're a tech one, aren't you? Ooh, you're alright. I could get you. I do want to start collecting the tech ones. What's it fighting? That's another big ass shark. Oh, just a regular shark. Oh, they're going to wreck the Spinosaur, aren't they? A level 80 Megalodon and a level 16 Spinosaur. They're going to absolutely wreck it. Just keeping an eye on our stamina. We're not going to get dropped into the Megalodon fight. But I am interested to see how long it takes them to kill it. They will kill him. They must kill him. Oh, I think he's running. Oh, we can finish him, maybe. Maybe not. Okay. He's strong and fast. We could dive bomb him a bit. There we go. Oh, there we go. So the Spinos didn't manage to get him. Sorry, not the Spinos, the Megalodons didn't manage to get him. It was ours. Our kill. Although, let's not go too close to the water or the Megalodon will get us. <laughs> I 
So I guess the levels and the numbers aren't necessarily everything then. If you have a really high level dinosaur, it's going to lose to just a dinosaur of a better... Not necessarily better species, but more powerful combat species. So if it's all based on percentages, you know, if it's a percentage of attack damage, it, then what they have as a base attack damage is going to be really important as well. I want to get him up to a thousand, uh, is it a her or a him? I just call them all her for some reason. It is a her. I want to get her up to, uh... What was the word? I was going to say, up to a thousand, yeah. Right, let's flap over to here, then we've got our stamina back. Hmm. We'll try and land somewhere on the edge of the island, so if we don't, if there's anything aggressive, we can maybe avoid it. Maybe we'll land on this tiny little island here, get our stamina back. So we've got full stamina to do a few circles of the place. Check the coast is clear. It looks like there might be a loot drop up there as well. I feel like our uh, eagle, yeah it's an eagle, our eagle could do a good job against most stuff at the moment, right. You, I think you're what I want, aren't you? Okay. So we've got a few of those ones. Ah, this is a cute little cove. And we've got a loot box that is probably going to vanish the second I land next to it, because that's what always happens. Okay, what is this? Ramshackle. We can already make chitin though, can't we? So it's a blueprint for something we can already make. Chitin. Yeah, I'll have to come. I'll have to have a look at that when we get back to the base. But that just looks like a blueprint, something we can already make. Ooh, that's bright. Okay, so I don't think there's any evil T-Rex is lurking in the in the wings waiting to Ooh, Tech Dino. Let's see, can we kill a couple of these? Um What the hell? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, so right click on the Spinosaur makes him stand up, right click on the Crocodile makes him do a spin, right click on the bird makes him pick things up. Oh, can I very sociopathically fly him out and, and drop him on top of a, uh, a shark? There's a shark. How do I drop him? Left click? No, that attacks him. Oh, no, that, that hurts him. Oh, I didn't want to hurt you. I just wanted to feed you to this shark. The shark does not seem interested. No, the shark is... The shark's interested, but he's going for land. That's a, another big shark. Is that another alpha shark? Or is that just how big these things are? That's just how big they are. Jesus wept. Right, that's not fair. Look how it's just swam from here to there. I bet you if I stick a toe in the water, those things are going to be on me. Running out of stamina, speaking of putting a toe in the water. Let's get over here. Right. Well, that makes life easy. I don't think we need to tame the dino then, do we? We just pick it up and take it home, if we can manage that. Let's see, so we've got... Ankylosaurus, level 4, and then, and then 
Is there another one over here? There. Ankylosaurus level 36. And is that it? If that's it, then we'll get the level 36. What's that thing? I don't know what that thing is. Cool. Right, I think that might be it for the Ankylosauruses. I mean, level 36 isn't great, but... It's better than nothing, isn't it? If this thing is actually as good as everyone was saying. Okay... There really doesn't seem to be any predators on this little island, does there? Unless you are, what are you? Another one of those things. Those things might be the predators, I don't know. How odd. Right, let's go kidnap ourselves an Ankylosaurus. And we'll figure out how easy it is to take back, like whether we should just trank it here, or whether we should be taking it back and then tranking it at our base. The last thing we want to do is fly it back and then have our dinos decide to murder it, that would just be very annoying. Right, let's get our stamina back so we can cross this bit of sea with it. I wonder if it takes more stamina to fly when you're carrying something. It wouldn't make sense if it did. There we go, look at that. That's fucking handy. And then I guess to land and recover my stamina, I'm gonna have to drop him. And then pick him back up again. Hopefully he doesn't wander off too far. Da -da -da -da. Level 46. So if we get like 10, 15 levels on him, it won't be too bad then, will it? Okay, so we'll put him down. Maybe not quite here. Ooh, we're just flying right into the sun there, aren't we? Sorry if you're finding that a bit blinding. We're almost there. We'll fly as far as we can and then we'll drop him. So I want to make the most of this trip. I want to get this trip done as quickly as possible so we can keep our eye on crystals. On the crystals. So if I drop you and I land and we stay away from whatever that thing is. Is he off home? I think he's off home. <laughs> Sorry, you can't go home. You you live with me now. I promise not to drop you on the sharks like I did to your friend. But you have to come and work for me. The pay is terrible and you're not allowed to unionize. It's basically Amazon. But it's better than being dropped into sharks. Slightly. So is this the stone one or the metal one? I guess the, the only way to tell will be to test it. I mean, I suppose I could go back and read the, uh, the comment that explained all this, but that sounds a little bit too much like due diligence and hard work and research. <laughs> Instead, I'll just whack stuff with this dino and see what happens. I think we're almost back now. Maybe one more, one or two more stamina bars just to get back. And then we'll, f the sun will probably almost be down then, which isn't great. <clears throat> then, then do we build our um, irrigation system before or after? We do the. Uh, we're gonna rest just after here. There we go. We'll rest here on this beach. 
Do we build our irrigation system before or after we put the roof on? I'm kind of thinking after we put the roof on. I feel like maybe if we try and do it before we put the roof on, we'll be in a bad position. Oh no! I'll save you. <laughs> yeah, because we don't want to build the irrigation system and then it just not work. That would be really stupid. What was that in the water there? There. Can you see it? Just to the left. Oh, it's just a croc. Okay. I thought it might have been a baryonyx. I do really want a high level barry. I'd like to see how good they are. Because um, the difference between Salt and Steve is kind of incredible, so. But I don't think I need too many crocodiles, so. I'm not, like, when I see another high level crocodile, it's not super impressive because I don't think I actually need that many of them whereas the baryonyx is I could see myself actually using a bunch of them because they can travel on land really easily as well basically I could see myself fielding an army of barries but not an army of salts and steves look I don't want to deal with you go away small thing Look at it just staring up at us. An army of them would be adorable. If you could le unleash an army of them on new players, I mean I am a new player, but I mean like fresh off the boat naked players, that would be hilarious. If I'd seen a, like 50 of them running at me on day one, that would have been fucking terrifying. <laughs> Mm, can we make it on this last bar of stamina? It's gonna be risky. If we fall into the water, we will die, probably. There's a lot of sharks. We're gonna go for it. We're gonna be brave. Oh, there's jellyfish. I don't like jellyfish. Delightful. So that's one of the two dinos got here. Um, we'll drop it down at the far end of the bay and we'll shoot at it. And hopefully none of our guys will get involved in it. We don't want it to become a fight. Realistically we should have built like a trap, shouldn't we? And then just dropped it into the trap. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop him here, I'm going to fly over here, put birdie down here, um, are you on passive, I want you on passive, where's passive, stance passive, there we go, and then where's it gone, there it is. I'm going to assume I'm faster than it. It also doesn't do humongous amounts of damage either. Yeah, so as long as I can stay down here, we should be fine at dealing with him. Just don't want... Like Steve or Spino or Salt or something to come running down and get involved. Uh, is it still conscious? Sorry, that's just me moving the dog because he's sat on my chair wheels. Where is it? Is that it? Right, shit, it's unconscious. Right, um... 
Oh no, fuck. Oh, for God's sake. How do I get it out of the water? Oh, you are fucking with me. It's gonna die. It's gonna die. I think it's gonna die. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I think you can do it. I believe in you. No! Health's going down, it's dying, fuck. <sighs> Can a crocodile take it out? Oh, what a fucking waste of time as well. Barry, come on. Can you drag him out? No, how do I drag? Oh, he's dead. Well, that was... Piss poor attempt at life, wasn't it? Oh, that was just embarrassing. <sighs> I am sorry. Right, we don't we don't do that again. From now on, we either tame it or we drop it into a special pen. In fact, we drop it into a special pen that we're going to build right now. That's what we're going to do during the night because I've got the stuff ready. We'll build. We'll get. Oh, where's the stuff going? What's that going? It's somewhere. Oh, it's in one of my dinos. The. Uh, this. And then we'll build a gate for it as well. Right, so how do we make the dinosaur gates? Okay, and stun dinosaur gateway, most dinosaurs in or out. Uh, 200 stone, 100 that. Is there a bigger one? I think there's a bigger one. Let's get a bigger one just in case. Gate. Oh. Behemoth. Right, okay, so it's just called Behemoth Gateway. 900 stone, 900 thatch, 900 wood. Huge dinosaur. I don't think we're going to be able to drop huge dinosaurs in it. So this one should do. So 200, 300 stone, and there's some wood. One, two, three. And we can't move. Wonderful. Let's just stick this in here, just, just for a second. One, two, three. And some wood. And some fiber. And some thatch. Right. Let's just put all this in and then gate. Dinos. Why can it not be crafted now? Oh, is this? Do I craft this in my inventory? I am telling you, that has stressed me out dropping that thing. Killing that thing by accident. Yeah, okay, so I craft it here. Right, and then we put the stuff away. And we try and see if we can build a trap where we can drop the dinosaurs in. And get them out afterwards. We'll just put these over here in our toolbox until I can figure out what the hell they are. Uh, arrows can go in the drugs box because, let's be honest, they're going to be turned into drugs at some point. Yeah, that was a waste of a poor dino's life and a waste of like, half an hour of my time and your time, and I do really apologize for that. Uh, will they break through a wooden gate, though? Reinforce gate, here we go. So stone, thatch, 60 stone, 20 thatch, 30 wood. Right, so we want stone, split, 60. And what was it? Thirty 
30 wood, so we want transfer and split 30, because I just don't want to go around putting them all back in. And then was it 20 thatch? I think we need to do thatch right here. Reinforced dinosaur gateway. A large reinforced wooden gate, there we go. Okay. So this little beachy area is just gonna get covered in my random buildings. I will almost certainly move house to somewhere. <clears throat> to somewhere better later on, because I'm sure that there are better spots to live in than this. Um, so this is temporary and it's a good place to just experiment with. So we've got one, two, three, six, eight, nine. Right, and then the gateway. No. Gateway. Oh, okay. Shit. Right. That's complex. Um, so you go here. Like this, and then you go like this. Let's see how many of them we've got. Okay, so we actually can put them there as well. Nice. That should. trap virtually anything that shouldn't it and then we've got three left of spares and there's the gate and then there's the ramp okay so we've got a place to we're gonna practice dropping some dinos in there now I think but <clears throat> I really do feel really stupid about what just happened there. That was not good at all. Barry, you can hold these because you're good at holding stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> right, where is uh, my bird? Where's my bird gone? That's a good question. That's actually a really good question. Where did the bird end up after it? failed to pick up um ah there he is okay so I saw a piranosaur piranosaur a dinosaur the thing that sparkles was I saw one of them over here here we go this thing can we pick you up And then let's try and drop him in so we can fly to like here. Okay, if we bank too much, he gets away. Okay, no, it's because you're hitting the wall, right? It's a good thing we're practicing. Oh, there we go, we've got him now. Okay, so. Bullseye! And then let's see if we can get out by shooting him. If we can see him, let's drop the torch first. So he's going to find a gap if he can, isn't it? We can kind of. Can we get in here? Yeah. Hi. So, I guess there's no gap. Your job's done. You're ready to become meat. Good. Let's turn him into dinner. Ooh, lot of hide. Fantastic. Okay. So it does seem like we 
managed sort of to build the trap there. That's a much better way of doing it than just dropping them and hoping for the best, definitely. Um, I am, I do still feel dreadful about that. Ugh, what a mess. Right, let's put away this hide and meat and stuff. That's not where hide goes anymore. Hide goes down here now. Because we ran out of room in a little box for it. So. One rock. The amount of random single rocks I pick up is just ridiculous. Let's get some meat and. I'll grab another little bit of spark powder to put in there. Two. Oh wow, so much spark powder. Oh, there we go. Oh, there. Yeah, I think I started making some gunpowder as well. Uh, yeah, a little bit of gunpowder here. Let's start maybe making something that goes bang. I feel a bit less uh, vulnerable to large aggressive dinosaurs. We'll see gunpowder in there. Okay, is it getting a bit lighter now or not? I'm tempted to take salt out. We can see if we can find where that um, alpha shark was, but at the same time, I'm a bit scared of it. I think we could probably outrun it. Everyone's been telling me I can't fight an alpha. You can't fight an alpha. If you see an alpha, run away. If you see an alpha, run away. And salt, I think we're kind of seeing that as a bit of a challenge now, aren't we, mate? Yeah, I agree, buddy. I agree, buddy. I think that is a challenge to your prowess, isn't it? Yeah, all right. We'll, we'll take you out to find the to find the alpha, then, little little salt. Salt has spoken, guys. He wants to he wants to fire. Apparently, this is no longer just the fish box. This is the meat and fish box because there's too much stuff. I'm just gonna stick all this stuff away. I'm gonna fill up my food. I shouldn't need a water thing because I'm literally swimming through the ocean. Although I shouldn't be able to drink the ocean, so you know. Broad as it's long, really. There is a fertilized uh, baryonyx egg in there, but I didn't want to hatch any eggs or anything when I wasn't, you know, doing an actual episode. I thought that'd be a bit shit, so. Right. We might lose salt now. It's entirely possible that we will lose salt doing this. It is entirely possible we will lose this fight. I genuinely don't know. I am curious though. And if we do lose salt, we'll also lose our otter and we'll lose all our gear and it'll be sad. But everyone in the comments will get to say, I told you so. So, you know, it'll be worth it. <laughs> just for that. <laughs> just to let everyone say, we fucking told you, you idiot. But. I have to see for myself. Everyone has bigged these alphas up so much. And this one's a babby alpha. It's like level 8 or something. Is that a shark? Is that a shark coming for us? I think it is, you know. Where's it gone? Should we maybe test ourselves out on this shark? It's got some friends, though. There's a lot of them, isn't there? A bit concerning, actually. Male Megalodon level 4, let's see. Keep an eye on my O2 stat. Dino's health's doing fine. We killed the first Megalodon. There's more coming though. Killed the second Megalodon. We need to get 
out. We're running out there. Hi. You're very pretty and a decent level. I want to take you home with me when I get my... Uh, now that I've got my flyer and my pen. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to collect you. I just really want to collect all the tech diners. They're so pretty. Right, it was at the end of this rocky formation, wasn't it? This could be such a mistake. I really don't know. Oh, I'm, I'm starting to like double guess myself now. Why am I doing this? Should I be doing this? Everyone's told me not to do this. I have to do this now though. Right, we'll let him get his stamina back. Let him have some food. Make him have a poop. There it is, there it is. I just saw it, it's there. I have seen it, I just, I literally just saw her. Where's it gone? Is that her there? Yeah, that's her there. Look how red she is. What level is she? Bit too late to be finding that out. Oh no, I'm stuck. Right, let's go. Um, let's keep. Let's move a little bit. Right, we've got chance chance to sort of check her level here. No, we don't. That's just a random male Megalodon who's standing up on his face. That's incredibly acrobatic. <laughs> Welcome to Ark Synchronized Swimming. Right, you're not her. I know you're not her. I don't know where she is, though. I seem to have a bunch of small fish following me. Where's she gone? <sighs> you come out here looking for one of these super duper alpha predator things to fight and it's just run away. Unless that was it, that can't have been it though. We got some metal tools from killing it though. Which is cool. But that cannot have been. The alpha. It wasn't glowing, it wasn't red, it wasn't big enough, I don't think. I mean, you can swim over to the body, it should tell us, shouldn't it? Megalodon. Is it? I just don't think it was. Oh, we've got 500% damage on this Sarko now. Let's have another look around. There's a dead Megalodon. There's a Megalodon. There's a dolphin nibbling us. What's this? Another nibbly dolphin. <sighs> I don't know. The water genuinely terrifies me, but I just wanted a one on one fight with this thing and I can't seem to see it anymore. same time I can't see anything that could have got rid of it. Uh, yeah, alright, I guess it's gone. I, d I genuinely don't know what else to think. I do not think we killed it. And I do not think anything else killed it.
but at the same time, I don't think it's here anymore. And I don't want to muck around with the water too much, because I don't know how to deal with it, really. The one thing I do want to do is see what that structure is down in the water, but again, it's scary. There's like a structure here. This thing. I don't know what it is. I'm kind of scared to find out, to be honest. Yeah, I'm really nervous in the water. That is a lot of sharks. Let's, yeah, let's get out of here. I wonder if that's a cave, maybe? Whatever it is, it's got an awful lot of sharks around it, hasn't it? Just do a little drive by on it. Look at them coming at us. <laughs> Three of them. What levels though? 20. And I can't see the ones behind it. There we go. Level 21 dead. We get some pretty good stuff for killing them, actually. And it goes straight into his inventory. Like, what's this? More crappy armor and like, primitive weapons and stuff. But like, yeah, let's let's kill them. Let's face our fear and kill these sharks. Oh, level ninety-two, maybe not. Take out the level 20 and then maybe we fight the 92 by itself. No, 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 it's coming. No! Fuck! Fuck! Oh no! Oh, we fucked up! We fucked up! We fucked up! We fucked up! Oh no! Oh no! Salt's having a fight. Oh no. Let's get on this rock maybe a little bit, that might help. Okay. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna boost our oxygen star a little bit actually. Yeah, cool. Yeah. 10% boost right. Salt! Oh, he's a good boy. Sarkos are just the best. Look at that. It's up, it just dominated down there. Let's just drop all this stuff. I'll only drop the stuff that I know what it is. 
So that, I have no idea what it is, so I won't drop it. And we'll drop a lot of fish, because we're carrying a lot of fish. Megalodon tooth. Oh, you good dinosaur, you. Let's give you a... Let's keep, just keep upgrading your damage, yeah, why not? So hunting Megalodon is actually not only possible, but to an extent profitable. We find cool stuff doing it. And Salt can 100% take on a level 90 Megalodon. Where that alpha went is an absolute mystery though. I'm kind of upset by the whole thing. <laughs> <sighs> I thought I was going to get an opportunity to prove myself. But no, Alpha's gone. So what we'll do is we'll go back and see if we can get some crystal. See if the crystals respawn. Because that, that, that was the most important thing to do today. Was uh, build that greenhouse and see how it works. Let's give ourselves a second to recover our stamina. There we go. Is this a live Megalodon? Not anymore! Crocodile beat shark. To be fair, crocodiles are one of the few animals that like are actually scary in my opinion. Crocodiles, alligators, that type of thing. They're little horrifying bastards. Even though they're not that little, they're just horrifying. So hunting sharks good, dealing with jellyfish bad. Fair enough. I can my brain can understand this level of complexity. I'm not scared of you anymore. Now the issue is there'll be a lot more stuff in the sea that I'm not aware of at this point, won't there? Megalodon is just one of the things that lived in the oceans during, you know, the Jurassic, the, Pre the Cretaceous, all these eras. Megalodon is just one. So, considering they're everywhere, I'm going to assume that they're not even the most dangerous one that this game has. Like, they're, they're by far they're not, not, not the most dangerous one this game has. So, we need to be careful not to become overly cocky. Salt. Salt is awesome. But he's not immortal. Even if he might disagree. Lazarus Chowder. Your body will need less oxygen. Oh, okay. Uh, helps you stay hydrated. So we've got f I've got three recipes now. I don't know how to use them at all, so I've just been putting them in the cooking pot as a storage place for them. Because that's how I do all the things. I just don't know what to do with them mostly. I just stick them in places. Oh, you're still following me. Good boy. Stay. Right, let's go see if these crystals have respawned now then. Um, we do now have a mini dino pen to put anything we want to keep in. Uh, I can't believe that we just <laughs> tranked it in the ocean. Poor thing. Anything interesting lurking in the waters? Doesn't look like it at the moment, does it? No, it doesn't look like it. I'm hoping for a really good Spinosaur spawn, but unfortunately, every Spinosaur that I've seen recently has been below level sort of 20, below level 30. They're, they're really poor. He says, with far too much confidence in his ability to deal with a higher level Spinosaur. 
Let's be honest. Even a level 20 or 31 is more than capable of ending me. More than capable of it. Um, so. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be overly eager for them to. For them to be back. For them to be higher leveled, really, should I? It doesn't look like the crystals have respawned here. Either that or I'm missing them, but I could have sworn they were up here. Which is frustrating. Not as frustrating as those fucking insects, though. What the hell's... Is that just one of the... Oh no, insects... Ah, go away. Nice. Um, we'll upgrade your carry weight. I want to get your carry weight to a thousand, then we'll probably just pump it into stamina for a bit. Right. If the crystals here haven't respawned, then that kind of means I'm going to have to go to the other place. And I only know of three places to get crystals, and if these ones haven't respawned, then the one in the redwood... Uh, that one there hasn't respawned, which means it's the volcano. Which I'm not looking forward to going to again. It scared me the last time I was there, it will scare me this time I'm there. Literally all I wanted to do this episode is build a fucking greenhouse. That's it. That was my goal. That was my goal. And I've ended up fighting sharks and... Drowning Ankysauruses and... <laughs> a hundred other stupid things that I shouldn't have done to poor dinosaurs. Maybe I can pick up one of the snakes. Drop their asses in the ocean and they get eaten by megalodons. S seems fair to me. So I'm gonna flap over here because I want to get um, one of those water skins. I'm going back to the. If I'm going back to the volcano, I want to bring some water with me, and we're gonna have to be quick, because otherwise we're gonna be flying in the dark, which is just a nightmare. And they're the only three places I know of that have um, crystals. I'm going to assume that the mountain up in the cold area probably has them. I mean, let's look at the map. There's a mountain up, up that sort of way. Oh no, that sorry, that sort of way in the cold area. But I'm going to also assume that that's going to be a horrible place to go. Where are they? Did I put them in here? Yeah, okay, so how do I use it? Uh, let's put it on zero, and do I just go into the water and click zero? Yeah. Alright, cool. And um, we've got food, haven't we? Yep. And um, for some reason we have multiple of the same tool, which we should not need at all. We shouldn't need because I don't think our bird can carry enough that we would like break a tool collecting it. So which is closer then? Yeah, the volcano is definitely closer, isn't it? Yeah. All right, fine. Volcano it is then. It's kind of the only option if we want to actually get this done. Look, there's a drop in the swamp right on the beach where I suffered for so long. Whatever should I do? I should fucking avoid it, that's what. We are going to have to land in the redwoods, which I've mostly avoided doing up until now. Apparently the redwoods are just as bad, if not worse, than the swamp. Which is a concept that fills me with joy. But I think the the last time I flew through here I managed to find like a plateau to land on and that was basically empty. Um, so hopefully I find a plateau again. Jesus, these are some big trees. Right. 
Right, our stamina is not doing well. And I'd like to choose where I land rather than be forced. I'm going to land on this here, this outcrop. I don't know why the screen's so pixelated around these trees either. It's very odd. Okay, there's a lot of uh, brontosauruses in here. Which leads me to believe that there's probably a lot of big things that would like to eat brontosaurus in here as well. Yeah, we're pointing in the right direction still. So let's just fly in a straight line and maybe get out of this fog. Because the fog isn't helping anything. Okay. Right, apparently you can command the dinosaurs and yourself to go to the toilet. Apparently, if you don't command the dinosaurs and yourself to go to the toilet, when your food bar is grey, bad things happen. That's the Spinosaurus. Let's stop talking about poop and start talking about, oh, uh, level four. Do you see what I mean? They're all dreadful. Did something just throw a rock at me? Or did I just poop? Yeah, I... There's just no point in me t spending the time and effort it would take to tame a level 4 Spinosaurus. It's just not worth it at all. I don't know why this I don't know why the Spinos are spawning so low when everything else is spawning. You know, in the 90s, 80s, really high numbers and whatnot. There's no crystal on the outside. Crystal's up at the top, up in the inside, isn't it? We'll probably need a rest before we get up there. Hmm. Can we rest on this little bit here? Yeah, we can. Fabulous. It was a nice view last time I was here. Now it's all weird and pixelated. I don't understand why. Let's just fly up to the top then. And then we'll go in. See how many crystals we can find. Hopefully a decent amount. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh dear. I'm flying. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. I knocked a bottle on my keyboard and I flew off my dinosaur. <laughs> forever it gave me hope for a second or two that I might somehow survive like I'd just get flicked off the bottom and land in the water or something but no no do you know something every time I set a goal every time I set an actual goal on this fucking game everything goes tits up Every time I say, I am going to do X, it just goes terribly. Ah! Oh no. <laughs> okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Right. There's only one appropriate response to this. 
and it's do exactly the same thing that we did last time when it went really badly wrong. It's just charge in repeatedly and hope for the best. So. Al. Al is a bit better on land than um, salt will ever be. Let's get our food and our water. I love you salt, but it's not really your it's not your game this mate. Um what we're gonna be doing. Right, Al. We're gonna head roughly this way. We probably don't have time to do it before night falls, do we? We'll go back and we'll get ourselves a set of that tools. We've got some tools. Al has terrible stamina. Yeah, that is an issue with Al. He does just have awful stamina. But he's really fucking strong in a fight, so... No, there's no point getting tools. We'll just make ourselves some uh, torches. We need that, we need wood, we need thatch. Oh, we need stone for torches? I didn't know that. Uh, we'll make ten, I think, yeah. Just because I don't know how, how long we're going to be tromping around in the dark for. So we'll make ourselves a bunch of torches. And then we'll do our best to reach our body. Again. Oh, for fuck's sake, it's like what happened in the swamp, isn't it? It's just gonna now happen in the redwoods. It's just gonna be me banging my head against death again and again and again. Oh, I knocked an empty water bottle over. <laughs> Why am I being punished so much for my clumsiness? Alright, let's go. <sighs> okay. It's going to be a bit of a trek. It's going to be a long walk. But we're on a very strong dino. He's got food, I've got food, I've got water with me, we've got a bunch of torches, and we know roughly what direction we're heading in. Let's wait and recover our stamina. We might need to put some points into this guy's stamina, because it's just terrible. His health is incredible, but his stamina's awful. Although that might just be Allosaurus's, I don't know. Looks like we're going to have to cross a little bit of swamp to get there as well. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Ooh, that actually took a bit of his health off, quite a bit. Okay. Literally, this crossing point here might just be the end of our journey. As quick as we can, as quick as we can, as quick as we can away from the swamp. Alright, we need to recover our stamina. Doesn't look like... Oh no, Otto! Otto the second! We have really bad luck with otters, don't we? Right. Yep, we're heading in roughly the right direction. 
this walk is going to take forever because he's just got such a lot of stamina. I think maybe just don't sprint with him and it might be quicker. Are you going to go for it, little one? I would not recommend that. Yeah. Oh, but if we don't sprint, look how slow he moves. Oh god, there's red. Oh no, I see red glowy stuff over there. And I don't have my, my, my spyglass to see what it is. Is it just... Is it just the pack book? I think it's just the pack book. That's all. That's what I'm going to tell myself anyway. Oh wow, like a whole ruin type thing. That's cool. I don't want to explore it yet. I don't want to explore anything in this hellhole. Uh, can I walk over this? Yeah, I can. He's not the best swimmer, Alasaurus. That's a Barry. They're very small compared to Alasaurus. We're being attacked. What by? Ah, piranha in the water. Right, that's the mountain where I went and got supplies at one point. There's another glowy red thing over there. I think it's just the alpha of the, uh, so not, not like alpha dinosaur, just like the leader of the pack. Pretty sure that's something I need. Check our map again. Oh, we've gone wrong here big time. We need to turn and follow the river. At least now we've got to the river, we've got a bit of a... Yeah, there's the, there's the uh, volcano. Oh, 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 flying... Uh... What is that? It's like a brontosaurus, but spiky. Oh, I should have made another spyglass. Yeah, I should have made another spyglass before coming here. Don't even think about it, little ones. They're not thankful. Right. That is a tiny monkey man thing. Well, I mean, I say tiny, I am stood on a massive gorilla, a massive dra- uh, Jesus Christ, why did I say gorilla and then why did I say dragon? Dinosaur. Are you bigger than me? If I get off, will he punch me in the face? It's Bigfoot! Hi, Bigfoot. Put taming food in last item slot to feed. Oh, cool, so you can just walk up to the monkey man and tame it. Have you entered the Stone Age yet? You're really cool. Oh. Yep, you're right, Al. We are wasting time here. Oh! He does not like it when you poop! My dinosaur pooped and it turned him aggressive. What the f- He died because he wasn't happy with my dinosaur toilet manners. Fair enough. Another otter. That's not my otter, is it? No. There's a couple of dinosaurs down there with... One of them's got a red glow on its back. Same as this thing here. Alphas of the pack, isn't it? I don't dare get off my dinosaur to... to access it. No, it's got an orange thing. Someone in the comments literally five minutes ago told me if they've got an orange thing, they have special loot. I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Oh no, I don't, I don't know why I always click exit after getting off there. No, 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 no! There we go. I managed it, haha! Hit off. Jesus, that was level 80. What do we get? Should we have a look? 
Primitive metal shield. Okay, so we got a shield, and then... A print right, apprentice! Okay, I understand what the blueprints are now, I think. They're tiered versions of what you can make. Yeah, yeah, look, it says primitive. After the name, it says weapon slash primitive. And this says equipable slash apprentice. So it's a better tiered version of the stuff you can make. Right. Okay. We still need to cross this river of hell. Maybe up by these rocks. Oh, there's that level 4 Spinosaurus we were bitching about being too weak. Yeah, it doesn't seem too weak now. Now I just wish the thing wasn't there. What are they fighting? They're fighting a Rex or something, aren't they? Or is it, are they fighting Allo? They're fighting Allosauruses. Which means they could take me. Because that's an Allosaurus with a buff from being the leader of the pack. Yeah, if they see me, they'll take me on. Yeah, shit. Get out of the way of them. We need to figure out where exactly our body ended up when it slid down the mountain at 318 miles an hour. God. Right, we need to get away from the aloes and then we need to find our body. And our flappy bird and all of our stuff and stuff on a tree stump one. Okay. Wondering if maybe we get to the edge of the woods at the base of the volcano then we might be able to see it. Don't even think about it. Ooh, you need a fingernail trim. There we are, we're up there. There's our body. I'm going to assume our Allosaurus cannot carry... Sorry, our bird cannot carry the Allosaurus. Meaning we're probably best setting it to follow us. If we can find the thing. And then walking back. People, okay. Otto! Otto the Otter! You're kind of alive. If we get off here, can we slide over there? Uh, if I get off my dinosaur, am I just going to slide down this cliff again? Kinda, yeah, almost. Otto! No, 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 I want my inventory. No, let me have my stuff back. Let me have my stuff back! I want the shit. I want my stuff. There we go. There we go. Alright. Back on the dino, and then let's deal with our stuff. Okay. Drop that, and we'll keep all the torches, actually. Why not? Right. Okay, now. Where the fuck is our bird? Is a really good question. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Where did the bird go? I have no way of finding it on here, do I? Like, absolutely no way of finding it. Um, it'll have found the best spot to land after it flung me to my death, but we were really near to the top. We, like, approached the lip of the thing, so I think going up, I mean, we're sliding down. 
I think trying to go home is gonna be a best option. What a fucking mess. Oh, I want to do is build a greenhouse. That's it. I wanted to build a greenhouse and plant berries, that was it. And maybe murder a shark, but the murdering the shark was a secondary objective. The greenhouse was my primary concern this episode, and that's just gone well. Watch, we'll manage to climb up here now, and it should be like a level 116 T-Rex. Just like, hello, goodbye. Oh, we'll get up to the lip, and she just won't be there. There's no guarantee I'm going in the right direction. She might have flown down into the forest. She might be dead. Let's check. Right. Tim Donata died. Right. Argeventus. Argeventavis? Argeventavis. Is still up here somewhere. She's alive. Oh no. No 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 Oh no Right um I'm losing a lot of health just pacing around on this fucking volcano. There's gotta be a proper way in. Right, let's go down and let's find the actual way into the volcano maybe. Half of our dino's health, like it could just get wrecked by anything right now. That is an Argentus, but it's not ours. Oh, look! More Allosauruses! Fuck! Let's run away. Up this path? Is it a path? It feels like a path. This feels like the right way to go. Why am I flashing red? Honestly, why am I flashing red? My health isn't going down. My dino's health is going up. Thank you to the person who told me about holding H is an invaluable little tip that I can hold H and see more detail uh, about all the stuff that's going on has been brilliant. Um, that looks like a Rex. That thing there. Oh, this is not a good idea. Right, I'm going to promise myself something. If we die again, trying to, if we die now with our ally up here, that's it. We, we don't come up the mountain again for a bit. We just write it all off as lost. So we get one one rescue attempt from now on. Because that rescue attempt in the swamps was just a complete joke. So it's one rescue attempt per fuck up. Which I think is a good rule. I think we are still kind of heading upwards here, which is good. There's a lot of metal. It's good to know, but I mean, I don't think I'd ever want to come here without a bird. Uh, to be honest, after this, I don't think I'd ever want to come here again. I just pressed the wrong button by mistake! I dropped the ball on the bird. Okay. Okay, we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it, it's fine. We can make it if we try. Oh, this is actually worse than the swamp because it's just... At least with the swamp, it was charge, die. Charge, die. This is like... Cross half of the flipping map on the slowest dinosaur you have climb up a mountain, 
on the slowest dinosaur you have. And then die, probably, yeah. Honestly, it's getting to the point where if the Argumentivists are Argumentivists, if, if Flappy can't carry Al, I might just leave Al in the fucking volcano. They're not exactly rare. We've seen like five of them on our way here. Look! A crystal! Yay! The thing we wanted. Back when we still had hopes and dreams. Right, we're in the volcano now. This is all I've sort of seen of it. I landed like here and picked up some crystals and they've all respawned. I didn't even know. Wow, I didn't see that. I can't see the bird. It's not here, is it? He's not here. She's not here. Fuck. I don't know where she is, man. Yeah, if she's not here, I don't know where she is. Oh, no. Oh, she was so good. I don't want to lose her. Other option would be go and get another flyer and try and come and find her, I guess. Now we have to travel back through the redwoods at night. On Slowy McSlow Slow. Oh, I suppose we could just accidentally kill ourselves jumping down a fucking mountain. Dino's health takes a really long time to regenerate, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, that's not. If we get offered, does the health gen faster? No. Don't know why I'm calling it a her. This one's male. Call them all hers. Okay. We're not gonna make it back alive, I guarantee it. Not when we've got this mountain to negotiate, not when we've got such low health on the dinosaur. Not unless by some absolute miracle we end up stumbling on Argy. Oh no, we're stuck. Fuck. There we go, we're not stuck anymore. Just depressed. It's <laughs> an improvement, I guess. Um, we'll go to where we died and we'll have a look on maybe the other side of where our body was. See if we can support the bird. On today's episode, we're gonna build a fucking a greenhouse. No, fucking not. No, no, we're not. Um, we're not gonna be able to for a really long time unless we find our bird. Are you our bird? You're not our bird. Are you our bird? You're not our bird. I'm just run around whistling. Will that help? I don't know. I don't know the range on the whistle, so I, I don't. I don't think so. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm abandoning um, Al if we find. If I find the bird, I'm abandoning Al and just, and just leaving, I tell you. Sorry. I don't know if, if you don't like that, if you find that really heartless for Al and everything, I don't care. Al is slow. And to be honest, I don't like slow. It doesn't really bother me. Like, the power doesn't matter to me as much as the speed. What is that? It has very colourful wings. Is it going to kill me? Probably. Uh, okay. Let's 
try and get back up to where we died and then survey the uh, survey the landscape maybe. Alright, we can't seem to get up here, so that's fine. Ooh, that was a big one. What is that? Oh my god, what is that? That's a T-Rex. Oh, fuck me, that's a T-Rex, isn't it? Look how big it is. It's bigger than what we're on. By a lot, it's just killing everything it sees as well. Can we just sort of not? I'm gonna assume it has an even harder time getting up here. That's not where we died. Is it? This isn't where we died. No, we're not where we died. This is just a loot drop. I mean, we'll get the loot drop. Maybe. Might make this whole thing worth it. <laughs> it's not gonna make it worth it. Uh, ramshackled parasaur saddle. So it's a, it's a better saddle for a dinosaur I'm not going to use. Fucking marvellous, I tell ya. Right. I mean, I think this is a case of abandon all hope ye who enter. Like, we're, we're fucked. We just are. There is no, there is genuinely no hope here. Um, a bird is, is gone somewhere. The same as our pterodon is still alive technically in the swamp somewhere, but... Existing but out of reach may as well just be not existing really. There we go, we can get up here and up here and keep trying to- No, that's going to be the end of our dino. No, it's got one more stupid jump on it maybe, that's good. Once the dino's gone, which it will be soon, we'll do this on foot. Until we either perish or are successful in our quest. I'm going to guess that perish is far more likely. Which means we'll then need to go and collect more Argentuses. Argenti? Argentuses. We'll then need to go and collect more pigeons. And this time I will bring back two. Because I have learned from my mistakes. I haven't, and I won't have learned from my mistakes. I've learned from this particular mistake, and I guess the swamp at the same time, so I suppose it's taken me two times to learn that I should make, I should have two flyers, not one. I mean, I could level them both up and then breed them and then have better flyers. Oh no, we're gonna die. Yep, Dino's gonna go here. Oh no, yep, this is it. Oh dear. Oh fuck me, I am sorry, Al. I really am. You, uh... Kinda deserved a bit better than that. But you helped while you were alive. We cannot get up that mountain. I am 99% sure we are not getting our bird back if it's landed somewhere up on the mountain. Should we have a look around the base of the mountain or at least this sort of area here? Might have landed on one of these bits. These walking bits. Should we check our map and see where we are? 
gone a little bit too far around, I think. Then again, it flies. It could have gone wherever it wanted, really, couldn't it? God's sake. I don't think it's gone all the way up to the top. means it's either somewhere halfway up which in which case yeah we're just gonna die if we try and get it or it's along the bottom somewhere yeah we're gonna die no matter what we do but I have a feeling along the bottom might be the most likely for it to have gone Maybe. Again, this is this is 100% gonna end in our death. I <laughs> mean, it goes 99%. Now it's 100%. Yeah, this is gonna end in our death. It's probably gonna be that level whatever Spinosaur that we we're bitching about as well that gets us. That would be some sweet irony. Oh, Al. Oh. What injured me? Something hurt me and I don't know what. Go away. Fuck's sake. Hal's ghost, probably. God knows. Okay, so it's roughly around here where we went up. Isn't it? This is roughly where we flew up if we came in a straight line from our home. Well, I just can't get up, so. <laughs> Time to travel back? Yeah, that'll go well as well. Uh, we only survived because we were on Al and stuff didn't want to touch us. And I don't think you can, I can't give commands to dinosaurs that are like really far away, can I? No. So that's it. It's a case of just travel back now. Which will inevitably result in death. Marvelous. That looks like a tech raptor. That's badass. Obviously, it's going to kill us if we go near it, so we're not going to go near it. A lot, of, a lot more tech things over here. Is there more tech stuff around the um, volcano, maybe? Ooh, you're dead. What killed you? Oh. Huh. Typical. Yeah, would I mean? I don't know what to do here. Do we just... Do we try? I physically don't think it's possible for me to get through the redwoods. Which means I suppose we try at least, doesn't it? What's going to be hilarious is when someone watching the video spotted my bird at like... Like 20 minutes ago when I was looking for it and the comments going to be like, You fucking idiot, you were two minutes away from your bird. I'm oh, sorry, I didn't see it. Um, what if we built a raft? Find some water. 
Like, genuinely, what if we build a raft? That might work. What do we need for a raft? We need... Why is it not telling me? There we go. We need 75 hide, 250 wood, and 125 fiber. Are you angry with me? Right, fiber. We don't have our thing with us, so we need 150 fiber, was it? That's okay. We need a bunch of fiber. Let's get that first. This is... Oh, God. <laughs> no, no, no. No, 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 I had a good idea, leave me alone. No, I had a good idea. I was gonna survive. No, <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Ah, yes! Thank you for giving me hide. Why am I spurting blood? That's never a good thing. Oh no, why are you angry with me now? I'm sorry. Oh no, everything's pissed off at me. I'm sorry, guys. Run away, maybe? You're injured. Hide. Yeah, I'm trying. Oh, you prick. Really? I killed the predator and then got eat killed by you and your shit throwing? Oh, that's just disappointing. Otto the second was killed! No! Oh, my otter died as well! Oh no! Okay. Right, guys. We, uh. We lost Al. Um. He died. Yeah. Hi, Barry. Hi, Bonnie. Guys, I'm sorry, Al, your friend, he's gone. Um, he died heroically, giving his life to protect me and all of you. He was not walked off a cliff, no matter what you hear, okay? Good. And on that terribly sad note, me and my fabulous hair and beard are going to call it a day. That is the most depressing end to an episode I think I could possibly have. Next time, Salt and I are going to go over to the cold area and we're going to get some more Argies. We're going to try and bring back a couple, maybe. But, yep, that's it. I am very sorry. I feel like... Oh, no, some good news has come out of it. Look, Bonnie and Barry are finding solace in each other's arms over the loss of Al and maybe we'll have a, a little baby Baryonyx to add to the family. Maybe we'll name him Al in honour of our fallen brother's memory. That's all for today though. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye.